Hi, I'm Rachel, and today we're going to be going over how to subtract mixed numbers with borrowing. The important thing you have to learn is just like any subtraction problem, you want to line it up. If you have 60 minus 12, you want to make sure that you line up the 12 right under the 60, the 0 above the 2 and the 6 above the 1. Then you subtract. But we all know that 0 minus 2, we can't do that, right? That's, that becomes negative, and right now we haven't learned negative numbers yet. So we have to change the 0 into a 10. We're going to borrow from the 6. So we're going to make whatever number this is 10 more than it actually is. So this is 0, we're going to add 10 and make it 10, and we're going to borrow from the 6. We're just borrowing one number. So the 6 becomes 1 less, it becomes a 5. Then we just subtract like normal. 10 minus 2 is 8, and 5 minus 1 is 4. And that's our answer. You just have to remember that the 6 becomes a 5, so it changes, and so you're not going to you're not going to subtract 6 minus 1, you're going to subtract 5 minus 1 to get the 4. I'm Rachel, and thanks for learning with us today.